where I plot in like thing. Oh, oh my god. Just to catch everyone up, get them on board. Bring you to speed. Lexi's in town. Lex is back in town. We are spending our week in Malibu. We're having a little girl's moment, a staycation, one might call. And we're just kind of like vibing. We're chilling. vibing. We're chilling. Behold, the wetsuit. So patience is key. We're gonna start with the feet and just make sure everything is secure as we go up. It's gonna feel like oh, skin. okay. Yep. I hit the sweet spot. You want it all pulled up, all the way to the okay, wait. armpits. We slide it. Boop. There you go. Dude, it's so fun. I love being in a wetsuit. <laughs> That's our body part. Yeah. I don't, I don't really have a relationship with my feet though, so when I heard that, I kind of do. Yeah? Yeah. Good or bad, I have one. You know what I mean? Like, I feel like my feet and I are pretty close to each other. You know what? <laughs> my feet are, they're everything. My feet are everything to me. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Look at these girlies. I don't have toenail polish on. I have such square toes. I don't want to talk about my feet. <laughs> <laughs> okay, when I get a pedicure, yeah, they're they glow up. Yeah, they're cute. Yeah, they have potential. Mine only look good because they're painted right now. I'm going under. Go under. This lens. Do I need to buy this camera? The background's blurry, right? Like, and I'm just—I mean, I look fabulous right now, obviously. So that's what's making this clip look so good. Um, but no, this lens, fuck. Man, I feel like a woman. Good morning! Did you play with your best friend on the beach this morning? Yeah, yeah you did, yeah you did! Some morning matcha. Today's sponsor is Ritual and I'm so excited to be working with them for the first time ever because you guys, I am actually a paying customer. My card is on file. This is my, I believe, fourth month in a row. There's so many reasons why I love Ritual multivitamins. For starters, doesn't matter what age you are, boy, girl, they've got everything. I've got the Essential for Women Multivitamin 18 Plus. They also have men's vitamins, 50 plus, prenatal, postnatal, teen vitamins. Ritual is the obsessively researched multivitamin that's reimagining health from the ground up. It contains nine high quality nutrients from D3 to omega-3 that are hard to get enough of every single day, even with a healthy diet. So they're focused on filling in those gaps and not wasting time on the things that we do get every single day. All you do is just take two capsules every single day. There are no fillers, no colorants, no shady additives. They're super transparent about where they 
they source all their ingredients, their packaging is 100% recycled materials. I also love that they have a mint tab in every single capsule, aka these are minty. It ends up only costing $1 a day and you get it shipped and delivered straight to your door, making life so much easier. So if you guys want 10% off of your first three months, all you have to do is click on the link down below. Use my code Claudia when you check out. Thank you again to Ritual for sponsoring today's video. I love you guys. Seriously, this is an everyday morning, literally ritual for lack of a better word. I'm doing my makeup on the floor and I look up. Can you say hi? Hey guys. <laughs> Let me show you. <laughs> Your head is in the jar. Wow, wow. <laughs> <laughs> and I are potting at the beach. We stopped by the house while Phineas wasn't home to film an episode of Lexi's podcast. It came out so cute. We wanted to film that in silence and then we just enjoyed the backyard for a little bit and headed out before sundown. <laughs> it's all fine now. <laughs> and now we're suddenly okay. <laughs> Look at my hair. Thank <laughs> you. <laughs> this position right now that Peaches is in is unbelievable. We stopped by a little vintage thrift store. Your girl's been loving like button up shirts, and I just loved. The clock. I think that's so cool. Honestly, honestly, so cute and weird. <laughs> I don't hate it. And I kind of don't hate it with this outfit. Am I gonna leave it on yet? This totally reminds me of like, I don't know, the type of shirts that I wore in fifth grade. I don't even know. But then it also says like sexy. So like, I like that it tightens up on the sides and I think this will look really cute with just like some blue denim jeans. And then I also got this shirt because anytime I see something purple, I just have to give it a chance. This cute little high neck, turtleneck, long sleeve mesh shirt. And it's actually so see-through to the point where like when you're wearing it, you kind of only see the seams. Like I'm trying to show you guys how see-through it is with just one layer. There's no hiding with this shirt, but I think this would look really pretty with like a really nice fancy bralette. Hi. Hi. Mm, that's the spot. One more? Mm-hmm. One I more? I can get it. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, Claudia had plans. Insisted on a to-do list, you know, like FaceTiming mm -hmm. mm -hmm. activities. We're gonna hike. We're gonna cook. We're gonna... What else was on it? <laughs> we're, gonna we're gonna film. We're gonna grocery shop. We're gonna film. We're gonna do your podcast episode. We're gonna we're gonna do truth or drink. We're gonna beach day. Yeah, we're gonna have beach days. We're gonna go in the hot tub. We're gonna do Pilates, which I mean, we ended we up doing. Every, <laughs> every okay, single one of okay. Those okay this is that was okay, not the point. Okay, the that whole, was actually the entire. Right. Uh, that was not my point. So the theme of this week has been okay. First of all, we're just sitting. Get comfortable. Get your lemon water. Get your lemon water. Because it's just funny because it's it's obviously been such a long time since we've seen each other. For both of us, it's sort of wild how much we needed this without realizing how much we needed it. Like the thing that I said yesterday that made our minds go was that I was like, I feel like we were really trying to tell this week how this week was gonna go, but then our week was like, no, I'm gonna tell you how this week is gonna go. It was so beautiful. Like, it was just, the thing, the word that I keep thinking about is that 
it was just like the divine timing and it was so cosmic and like all of these things kept adding up everything that were just fell like into little, place yeah, yeah like little reminders but i think we needed each other we needed each other we needed that but i think we also energy. knew that we did we totally i know we're, we're gonna get so mushy we always get so much i know we get so i haven't mushy. even edited the podcast that we did together yet <laughs> but we were sitting holding each other <laughs> looking into each other's and eyes then, just describing and then, like, our love and then like the recording device was like the third wheel yeah in we're the podcast. so dramatic when you give yourself the time and space with someone and you know obviously that's difficult to do and it, it, you, it doesn't happen often like I'm recognizing it's and also because it doesn't happen that often like I'm, I'm appreciating it so much like when was the last time Claude and Lex had a whole freaking like chunk of time together just, a whole moment. just like sleeping in the same bed having sleepovers when was the last time i had a sleepover with my girlfriends i don't know every night oh. first night here's your room you know just like that's what you do like you got a guest room like you give it to your guests yeah i did i slept there the first <laughs> night <laughs> and then i don't know if you offered or if i requested for peaches to sleep with me the next night mm -hmm. and then slowly but surely i mentioned like, my and now i i'm not gonna sleep anywhere else <laughs> other than with claudia like i just i I go right to sleep. It's also, it's just so like so good. It's also been very chilly, so the body heat's nice too. Like at nighttime, it gets a little chilly here. Yeah. So like you can use all all the heat that you can get. But it's um, cute how like we've really just. I know. I also feel like we were not prepared for the types of like conversations that we were gonna have, the sorts of therapeutic and meditative realizations and lessons it's and all been these moments so we've long had. since we've been together and with y'all you know, we've been crying we've been laughing oh my god we've been i was holding her crying in her arms yesterday <laughs> like so dramatic but like i don't know female energy you live with your boyfriend i yeah. live with my guy best friend yeah he's gay it's not like a secret relationship forming no. but like we haven't had female time yeah all of my feelings are rising to the surface. Yeah, this of my is what emotions. happens when you, when you bring two Pisces together. I know. During a Pisces new moon. I know. We're just <laughs> being those bitches. I know, we really are. But it feels so good. It's so good. It's so good. It's so interesting. I Cherish this, your girlfriend. Cherish, cherish your, your girlfriends. girlfriends. Also, like, let's talk about the importance of adult friendships. Because adult friendships are something that, like, we are now starting to recognize what you have to value, what conversations you value, how much you have to value your energy and your time, down to just like who gives you energy, who accidentally subconsciously takes your energy in a good or a bad way. And there's like so many dynamics of like how deep a friendship can be and sometimes you want it to be simple and sometimes you want to go there. And it's just, I just feel like adult friendships are this thing that like you have to put hard work into but the reward is so high because that's what I learned throughout this past year, just being with Phineas and like being in a tight pod with just his family. Like I lost a bit of myself because I didn't feel that animosity. I didn't feel, you know, the feeling that I got from like getting to touch and like hold a girlfriend and not just like, you know, go on a hike in a mask and stuff. Having this little like pocket of time and just being like, all right, girly, it's you and me, let's go. Now I'm completely going on a tangent, but so many things have been resurfacing from like myself personally in my body and in the way that I like talk to myself and how I process things. I had like a new friend in my life just kind of pointed out and she was like, I think you finally feel safe enough and you feel comfortable enough to process these things and so they're coming out and your body is literally telling you you need to remove this from your self identity you need to remove this from your nervous system and that was all happening like before you came here and it's just all the conversations we've been having it's just like wild how everything is adding up and just it's been wild so that's yeah. like going into it i didn't even realize how much i needed this but how much my like body was prepared for it. I'm giggling like this is so intimate. Just yes. like <laughs> once again, I feel like you're like a third person, just like fly on the wall. But we're also definitely talking to you for yeah. sure. <laughs> I obviously like was a different person when I was 18, and so mm. it's supernatural if we had just grown apart and like had mm -hmm. those special years. And then you know you were a nostalgic friend, mm -hmm. but it's really cool that we're on similar paths. I know. You know because I, I know. left. 
moved. You know, mm. I moved away. And I suck at communication, so there was a hot little moment where oh. like we were just keeping up with each other socially. Literally DMs like every few months or just yeah. like little texts or like quick things. Not like frequent daily Not like how's your day thing. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Which I mean FaceTime, God bless. The power of FaceTime, truly. But physical touch. <laughs> just like Can't unbeatable. 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 Just yeah. hugging, crying, smiling yeah. like just mush fest. I just know. absolute mush fest. I know. So uh, I guess the moral of this <laughs> is uh, cherish your girlfriends, mm -hmm. evaluate your current relationships, figure out mm -hmm. who in your life maybe their season has passed, mm. figure out the strength in your friendships and definitely value them. Friendships are so, so, so important. Yeah. yeah. And I think too, like what I was kind of mentioning about how like different friends can offer different things yes. for you and also pull out different versions of you, like evaluating that and taking notice of that is not weird. That is you literally prioritizing what you want and what you need because at the end of the day, you should never feel forced to see someone, even if it's you on like a no specific You have no obligations no. to anyone. I you know. can pick who you want in your life that that is up to you and it doesn't even matter if it goes towards family yeah. members. Yeah. You can establish boundaries and you can protect your peace. Boundaries, girl. <laughs> Give it up for boundaries. This one's for the boundaries. <laughs> what is this? What is the point of this? Doesn't matter. I don't know. Maybe there's something. <laughs> Maybe you got some little gem out of it. There's gotta be <laughs> someone going through this too because that was the entire point yeah. before the camera is on. Just realizing we had such different expectations for this week and it yeah. was so much more. I yeah. think we just thought we were gonna be enjoying each other's company and mm -hmm. it was this huge heart space like uh, yeah. internal. Mm -hmm. I, I, okay, I know it's I'm like saying it's, a lot of words right now. No, it's like the week that we thought we were gonna have is totally fine, totally relaxing, totally amazing. It was chill and, vibes. And this, this week was like and... buckle up. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's exactly it. We yeah. thought we were just gonna enjoy each other's company, and it was like the universe just giggled at us. And I it was know. Like, oh, you just wait, but it was in the best way possible. So, I know. if anything, I'm just doing this for my future self to look back on and mm -hmm. be like, remember this well, week? Well, that's what's so exciting is like we've come together to this intensity because obviously we've seen each other throughout the years when I'm in New York or you're in LA but like it's been such a long time since we've had we've created Live this together. amount of space and time for yeah our friendship and it's incredible how much we've grown between those two long periods of times that like I don't know it's like the conversations we're having everything they're just way more complex and dynamic and they're just from completely different perspectives because we've grown and evolved I have a thought What's your She's thought? got a thought. Circling back to us being like little 18 year olds mm -hmm. versus being 25 now. Mm -hmm. That's massive. That's a huge difference. I seven know. years, a lot can happen in seven years. Yeah. We are new people and we honestly took some time off. Like, Dude, is she okay? Look at her eye. Did you see that? Peaches. Is she? She's okay. Anyway, sorry, I broke the moment. <laughs> Wait, but she <laughs> cover her with your shoulders. <laughs> we are new people. We are new versions of ourselves. Mm -hmm. Your 25 year old self is different even from 2020, yeah. like definitely different than 2019. And it's really beautiful that we're almost meeting as new versions of ourselves. Mm -hmm. And it's been beautiful, you know? Because mm -hmm. sometimes it's just, it's nice. Yeah. But this was like, that's our little so, lemon water chat for the evening. Our, should, should I call it that? Yeah. Even though I literally don't, it's only you that, have, that has <laughs> lemon an water. Empty and it's cup. like, there's not even lemon in it. Cup. Like, there's nothing in it. Like, there was not even a drop. But thank Anyways, you for coming to our lemon water thank talk. Thank you for coming to our lemon water talk. We love you, Los Angeles. Take care. Good night. <laughs>